Guys, what is up, man? We're thrifting today. It is half off. I am blazing my way to the first thrift store to try and get as many deals, as many steals as I possibly can. I wish I had my GoPro. I don't know where it is. I done lost that thing like my mom lost me in Walmart one time. But let's go in here and get these bangers. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Bro, I'm in here already just sniping items like nobody's business this is hard for seven look at this got the washington football team got this varsity jacket i got a jordan dang hoodie what is chaos man but yeah i want to be sniping up in here 360 no scoping boy like look at the leather on this hold on bro you got that Purdue Vintage Champion. They were charging 20 out of Personal their minds. Uh, tripping. But we got it right there for a steal. Hold on. Did I pass on this? What is this? Bro, y'all saw me just straight scope that LSU. Again, another one. 15 that was taxed. Got it for cool. Farsi jacket? This is a sweet little jacket. It looks like it's straight out the 70s. Kind of caramel and coffee. That Jean-Claude Killy made in... Korea? Yeah, I'm gonna add this to cart seven. My cart already is looking stupid. stupid. A little bit of that Nike Syracuse orange. Nike boys, Different tone and texture on the pocket. My God, 20 for the New York Giants crew neck. Oh that is crazy. God, crazy. $10, crazy. that ain't too bad. It is embroidered, I like the red hits. Oh yeah, that nice little cooked fried plantain color scheme. Perfect. The Jordan flight hoodie, then you got the champion hoodie as well. I'm gonna grab this one for sure. 25, so it's gonna be 12. God, 25 is insane. Prices, prices going up. So I also have secured a, a jersey in here. It is that Colombian soccer jersey, long sleeve, the 2014 World Cup. Bro, 15, someone has to do a scientific study on the brain rot these pricers have in the back. Like for resale, that would be fine. But for the thrift who got the items for free, that's yaxed beyond all belief. Bro, not the very rare. Two stripe what? Adidas. Tripping. They also got the disgusting turf jets. These are bloody shoes. I actually love this silhouette. I wish I would have kept my pairs, man. They done pinch my toes. I got them half a size too small. Tripping. On the cool, these are very clean, very sick. And they're only $7. If these were my size, I would most assuredly get these little flamingo looking shoes. Hey, there ain't no way, dude. This right is no way. beyond crazy. They actually got a couple of right vintage no tees. It's been forever. Made in USA, man. The Badlands National Park. You got one baddie, three wolves. Good God. Crazy adult nature film. And then you got that cat, Mazatlan. That boy is chilling. This is single stitch. Six. I gotta grab it. That is so surprising because the t-shirts are usually super ran through, pillaged. But we got two. Okay, guys, so I've done pretty much all of my browsing and I've separated the clothes accordingly. Now, these are some of the items I pulled as soon as I walked in before I even had the camera rolling. I just came blazing in, grabbing items. NFL jacket, 20 bucks for that Washington Native Americans football team. Then 40 is insane oh for this varsity jacket. It is cool, the colorway, man, San Francisco-esque. But they are yaxing and on the Capitals. Jesus Christmas, $40. These dudes are smoking that sausage. I wish I might. Then in terms of things that I definitely want to grab, I have to grab the multicolored $20, that LA one with the eagle on the tag. My boy's trying to eat an alpha bit, bruh. Predatory fifty. I also got to get that Purdue Champion 20 is still tripping. So basically, if I spend 200 bucks, I get 100 off and that's where the discount kind of caps is at 200. So I'm gonna have to calculate all of these items and see what the total cost will be. That's why I have them separated. I definitely have to grab this piece. So I just sorted everything in total. It's gonna be $209. So these are all the items I am leaving behind just because they either were flawed or extremely high priced. But let's get to cashing out and utilizing that big D. Discount. All right, y'all, it is hot as blazes and three giant bags are what I have walked out with. I spent $104 total, 13 items. 
not necessarily the biggest steals, but they're all really cool, high quality pieces in my humble opinion. So it's like a week later and we are back in the same locality with another half off big discount. And look at this, they got a New England Patriots NFL jacket. I could have this for the NFL life, right? It's not too crazy, but the price is 64, even half off. It's straight stupid. I wish I might. Then you have another one. Another one. This isn't two nuts, but it's only 34, so it'll be 17. Wait a minute. Washington football team. I might. Now let's go ahead and check what I've actually found thus far. Okay, infrared. Nice little CB. Bro, this is nuts. It's only $4. This would be like two bucks for your boy that Codeine Draymond. Neon icon, surf style, and then this customized vest. Wow. It's pretty nuts. Pretty nuts. So yeah, I gotta get this as well. It's gonna be seven. seven. So I got some more light work, man. Nike track jacket, Fleur de State crew neck. Nothing too crazy. The swing step vintage crew neck. The Tampa Bay, it's gonna be like a dollar. I love camo that incorporates the animals that you're trying to murder whilst wearing the camo. Very nice. Star Wars tee, new school, still cool. Mountain, and of course, a little thrasher. But yeah, I need to find some things for my son. I got that buzz, and uh, can try and find some other little fit items to fully utilize this discount. Y'all, check out this absolute heater for my son. The Polo Bear Cardigan. Bro, my mission is to make cardigans go hard again. I need it, 350. Dude, these are clean. The Rasta 6.0s, size 11, 35. All right, so we are up out of there, man. Another great half off day. Dude, the sneakers really came through and everyone always goes to the shoes first. I'm surprised the dunks were there, but hey, those who know, no, you dig. I don't feel like counting, so about money counting. But yeah, let me place everything down. Really, it's just the dunks. I also got some Spider-Man foam posits, wow. and then the uh, the surf style. That's really what hit today, man. I got some other hodgepodge of stuff, but those those three items, smackers. And alrighty, class. So we are back, and as y'all can see, man, I think my best find of the day has to be or of these two days has to be the Rastafari 6.0 dunks. These are very, very clean. You guys can tell, just look at these. Absolutely flawless. These are size 11 and they will be for sale on my website, which is thriftheavenvintage.com. I'm gonna try and get these released the same day this video drops, which is a Tuesday. And speaking of Tuesdays, I go live every single Tuesday with a ton of items that I live auction on whatnot. If you guys haven't used that app, basically, it's where you can buy stuff and people live auction the items. My dude, Jesus did not bleed blood. He bled wine and we sip it. No vampireness, but we're Catholics. So I start everything at a single dollar. I have 80 plus items loaded up and I like releasing my videos on Tuesdays because after the video drops, then you are blessed with another hour and a half of extra content. You guys can tune in to shop or just tune in for the chat and the buffoonery and the lives. So if you guys don't have a whatnot account, Click the link in my video description and you'll get $15 off your first purchase on the app. So say you got this Harley T for like 20 bucks, you got it for $5. I do wanna highlight a couple of items on this rack and I am gonna unbox something in this video as well. So this ain't the end, boo. This ain't the end. You got that Beretta, don't nobody do it better. And you have the Ministry Vintage Banty on the Stedman Super High Crew single stitch. I also have a Bauhaus tee that will be for sale as well. Look at the Cookie and Grover. Like I'm telling y'all, man, I have all types of heat just lined up every single Tuesday, a variety of styles, but this Bauhaus is absolutely nuts beyond crispy. But we have stuff for everyone, man. I mean, we got the little outdoors gear. We have some big old flare jorts, Y2K style tees. You got band tees, college crew necks, Grateful Dead. So it will go down at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time this Tuesday and every single Tuesday. All right, so tune in. And if you guys don't see anything on the live auctions, definitely follow the Thrift Heaven Vintage Instagram because that's where I let you know if something hits an auction or if it hits my website instead. With that being said, I have a box that I've been sitting on for months that I want to unbox because I truly do appreciate you guys who send me gear. 
and sometimes it just takes me a while before I actually get to unboxing it on camera, but I want to crack into this one. It's a big daddy, okay? It's for my boy Josh Berges. Thank you so much, Josh. Let's get into it, Joshua. Oh, my lord. This is what I'm seeing, guys. And we have a little letter in here, so let's read it. This looks chock full of items. <clears throat> so the letter says, Mr. Can 2. My name is Josh and I've been a long time fan. My little bro is the one who got me into your content back in the day. I've been watching ever since. Just wanted to hook you up with some things I thought were dope where I'm from. That is the land of entrapment. What? Good old Albuquerque. Do as you please with the items, but I got Griffey some Lil Fuego. Didn't you know his wife since I ain't got too much your besides 190 deal guys that is not what this says at all but this is very hard to read hey and tell little kinky twist we need that kinky speaks god bless and stay something through for one boss to another salute yes sir shout out my boy josh burgess okay i'm not gonna lie y'all my boy josh's handwriting is kind of crazy to read that was a bit of a struggle but I know uh, it was good intentions, man. I got some second grade penmanship prayers for old boy. Kinky, how would you rate this handwriting, bro? We got Kinky in the mix, man. How would you rate this handwriting, okay. dog? Uh, I give it a 10 out of 10. What? How is it compared to mine's? <laughs> Way better. Stop the cap. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get into this box, man. All right, the little Euro tour. Oh, the 2000. This is dead stock too, UEFA. This is something for my son. I appreciate you, bruh. This is a woman's shirt, my dude. Sweet. This is definitely a woman's shirt. I don't know what you're telling me, but I might get the surgery. Look here now. Oh, there's something else for young Griffey, the Tommy for your mommy. Dude, this is hard. The two-tone, the green embroidery. Thank you, my dude. Yeah, if you guys got kid clothes, by all means, I'll take them things. My son wears two teeing up. Ralph Lauren, USA, hard. Another polo, Ralph Lauren, the marbleized. Good God, this looks like some clean bathroom tile in a mansion that somebody urinated on. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. But regardless, I appreciate it. The St. Louis little kids hat, banger. Oh my God, bruh. What is that, Mufasa State? No, no, that's Simba State University very hard i appreciate that all embroidered we got some speedo swim trunker doodle doos right in time another speedo pair everglades holiday park home of the gator boys that's pretty sick this gator is legit munching on a skull cap my dad has this shirt i've got a twin with him founding fathers and it is my size yes i'm going to rock this man the native american chieftains let's see if there's something here that i can hook the kinks up with oh the panthers he was just talking about it, man. He was saying how he wished Houston got Bryce Young, so maybe he'll be a, a Panthers fan now. I definitely didn't say that. He said that. Nope. Stop the What cow. else we got? Peyton Manning. <laughs> Sick. Kinky also loves the Colts. Bro, the kids' clothes, I feel like, are just smacking out of this league. You got the Cubs, literally Sammy Sosa smacking. Bro, look at this. The Blackhawks windbreaker. Tell me why. This is actually fly as hell. But tell me why I had my son in a Blackhawks jersey earlier this morning, man. Then I don't think he liked the texture of it. I put no undershirt on him, so that's my fault, man. Young boy was chafing. Then you also have the Animal Kingdom, Disney, little Albuquerque tribute tee. Another one. Now we have the, the Albuquerque stuff, the Lobos from New Mexico. Another little Thomas piece. This one is clean, though. The long sleeve. That Tommy Jeans back hit, militarized green. This is sick, man. The universe is just a book of way. Then another Thomas? That Tommy Sport? Put that thing in sport? More that Tommy for your mommy? And then last and not least in this box, we have a windbreaker. Is it Reebok? Is it McGregor? It is the USA Olympic windbreaker. Oh, you got the earth, the wind, and the rain. No fire. That whole box was full of it though. So thank you so much to my boy. Oh wait, there was one more piece. Oh dang, this is actually a fire little button up. I think this will fit him right now. 18 months, yeah, this is perfect. perfect. So thank you so much, my dude. I really do appreciate you. I'm glad I waited to unbox this a year later because now all those items will fit my son or will very near fit him. 
But yeah, man, overall, I just appreciate y'all for watching this. Everyone who supports me in terms of dropping comments, likes, and just viewing in general, I definitely cannot thank you guys enough. Everyone who buys gear, y'all literally are fueling the fire for me to keep doing this and to support my family. So thank y'all for that. But uh, yeah, until next time, live the dream, eat that ice cream. My battery is about to die, so this was perfect timing. I will catch y'all very, very soon. See ya. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life, I roost And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get